Hello, welcome to Dirt Rally 2.0 with Mistex 2.4. Today we're at Rockton Plains Reverse once again in Monero, Australia. And today's kind of another special one. I'm in, I'm in the next car class, which is the H2 rear-wheel drives. And I usually start with the uh, Alpine Renault uh, A110 car. I love this car. Um, before, I really couldn't drive it. I was having a lot of issues. Like I would try to drive it every time, but I was always really, really slow in it. And I really couldn't figure this, the tune out for it. Well, I think I have finally figured it out and did get a world record today here in the Alpine. I haven't driven any of the other H2 rear wheel drives. I don't think that I will until the time is beaten and then I'll either try to beat it with this car or a different car next time because I have a feeling I'll probably go faster in some of the other cars, so I'm just going to leave this one up here. Alright, um, I am going to look at the tune real quick here. Let's make sure we got it loaded. Alright, so for the tune, we are at front toe at zero, front camber is at negative point nine zero, rear toe is at positive nine zero, and rear camber is at negative 1.50. So those rear settings are to try to keep the rear end from sliding too far out. Because this car, it slides, it likes to slide a lot. I mean, they all like to slide a lot, but this one's really hard to control with uh, its slide. Uh, let's see here, the brakes. I have turned the brake force down to 1225 and brake bias is at 66%. Uh, I turned the brake force down this much because even at 1400, I felt like it was way too squirrely for me and it's a pretty light car, so it stops pretty well with this amount of brake force. Uh, for gearing, anyway, for here, we're at first gear of uh, 0.350, second gear of 0.522, third gear 0.734, fourth gear 0.914, Fifth gear, 1.075, and final drive is at 0.215. Like I said, for this stage, the gearing is one thing you probably will have to change depending on where you're at with any of the tunes that you ever pick up from anybody anywhere. It's kind of one of those things you gotta you gotta figure it out, or at least try to. Um, okay, and for the dampening, we are on front slow bump is at plus two. Uh, front slow rebound is at plus one, rear slow bump plus two, and rear slow rebound at plus one. Um, I tried a bunch of different settings. So this car doesn't have a differential or differential settings. So I had to get the handling figured out from the suspension itself. I was running plus four on the slow bump. It actually doesn't feel too bad at that. I think I could still drive it that way. Um, I tried really soft with the bump. It was a bit too soft. I was I was lifting a wheel because I had the rear spring rate so low and the roll bar in the front was quite a bit stiff. So we were lifting front inside wheel around corners. Not the greatest. It was really spinning up the, a tire too. I think I may have been lifting a rear tire a bit as well. Um, let's see here. For springs, we've got front ride height at negative four. Uh, front spring rate is at 43.39, front anti-roll 13.50, and rear ride height is at negative 10. So I've got the rear lower than the front, which is to help compensate for the oversteer, make it understeer a bit more, hopefully. And then the rear spring rate is at 36.32. So the rear is a bit softer than the front which is also to hopefully not get as much oversteer and kind of tone the rear down while it's sliding. It, it slides really nice now. You can still overdo it fairly easy because this car is kind of hard to drive, but if you get the angle just right with it, you can really power out of the corners with it now. And I'm really enjoying it. Like I am really enjoying this car now. I'm happy to say that actually, and I'm happy to have a video about it finally. All right, let's, uh, Go head down. There's going to be in car me driving the live the live drive of it, and then there'll be the leaderboard, and then outside car replay. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Five. 
left of a crest into slow six right and turn square left. 30. Right left long, opens to crest. And six right of a crest long, tightens four. Opens of a crest into three left long, tightens two. 30. Four right long over crest, 50. Middle of a crest, 120, crest, 50, keep left of a crest, into 4 left long, 30, flat crest, 60, 5 left, 30, 3 right long, opens of a crest, 30, 5 left of a crest, very long, tightens, 2 long, into 4 right long, Titans 3, opens very long, last junction, into 6 right, opens of a crest, 50, caution, 3 right of a crest, Titans, into 2 left, opens 30, 5 right long, over crest, into 3 left long, Titans 100, middle of a crest, 80, right long, opens of a crest, 30, right left long, tightens, into three right tightens, into three left, into four right, opens, 30, two right tightens, cut maybe of a crest, into caution, four left of a crest, four right, into five left, Opens of a crest, 80. Back middle of a crest, 100. Back right of a big jump, 50. Four left long, tightens, 30. Four left of a crest. Into four right long of a crest. Into four left. Opens of a crest. Into five right of a jump. Into four left long, tarmac, 50. Six left, opens of a crest, into five right, opens of a crest, into five left, opens 100. Flat right of a jump long, 80, caution of a narrow bridge, two left. Into don't cut, three right, opens of a crest, into turn, four left of a crest, 50, gravel, four left long, tightens three of a crest, into four right don't cut, opens, into flat middle of a crest, into five left, into four right long, tightens, into flat middle of a crest, 100, dip, into six right, into caution, four left, opens into a narrow bridge, 60, six right, into five left long, opens, 30, four left long of a crest, tightens back camber, caution, tightens, don't cut, three of a bridge, into two right long, tightens of a finish, 80. To stop, well then. All right, here we are at the leaderboard for Rockton Plains Reverse Dry. And first place in the Alpine Renault A110 1600S. It is the H2 rear wheel drive class. For the stage time of 332.921. And second place, I've seen this guy at the top quite a bit, Zombie Slayer. Uh, he has a 333.933. Um, <laughs> when I first started here, what was my time the first time? It was like a 347, I think, when I very first uh, drove the car here. And then I dropped it eight seconds. And it was down to like a, like a 337. And then I was like 0.7 off of this guy's time and I kept tweaking the car and I was like, wow, oh, man, I can get it. Once I was at 0.7, I definitely wanted to have it with the with this car. Since you don't see it at the top too often, it is very quick. It's probably the hardest one to drive, I think, in this class. It definitely was for me. Absolutely hated it before, even though I loved the car. All right, that's gonna do it. And there will be a TV replay. And I will talk to everybody next time. Peace.